When we look at LLMs, Gen AI, uh, is it a hype? Or you see it's a transformative technology at the scale of Linux kernel? So uh, as a good mathematician, I will say yes, because it's both. There is a, a ridiculous amount of hype in that space, obviously. There is so much uh, uh, a completely unfounded and, and unrealizable uh, uh, statements being made about AI and, and no, this is not intelligence, this is autocorrect on steroids. But there is really, really useful and interesting and transformative technology in here. If you look at the way this can make your life easier, everyone loves to talk about, oh, this is going to replace programmers, it's going to replace journalists, when in reality it's a tool that can make that work better, easier, faster, it can be, it can help you with editing, it can help you with these simple repetitive tasks. If you need to remember how to do a CSS selector, the LLM can do this for you. So to me, the, the not so shiny, not so hypey part of this technology is the one that's interesting in how it helps knowledge workers like journalists, like technologists, to be better at the job and to, to more quickly get to results. And that's where I think this is a transformative technology. And all of these things, of course, are being done with open source models. And so there is you know, the arch back to what we were talking about. A ton of the underlying technologies are open source, and that's good. So much of this is then driven by the data, and that's where we need to talk about open source data, open data, what does that mean? How do you defend data against people who just want to steal it, just want to take it from you? There are a lot of interesting topics beyond that. But at the end of the day, it's another open source revolution.